there's a place in the Southwest where each sunrise brings a stunning mountain view and every home is a mountain retreat. Let me take you on a journey of the reserve at Red Rock Canyon. This community is a true expression of rugged mountains embracing opulence and luxury weaving itself into nature. From its carefully curated professionals designing its award-winning common spaces and residential architecture, only industry leaders will be fusing this luxury community with sustainability. So that of course would mean that they enlisted none other than Blue Heron Design Group to build the very first spec home so that they could still embrace the nature and beauty that's in the surrounding area, yet bring all of that luxury into the first residence. The reserve at Red Rock Canyon will be just a short 20 minute drive from the heart of Summerlin, downtown Summerlin, and the same distance to the nearest grocery stores. You can expect to drive about 30 minutes to the heart of our city center, the Las Vegas Strip, and also 30 minutes to the Harry Reid National Airport. But to me, the best part about this community is that it is right in the heart of Red Rock Canyon Preserve. You will be able to enjoy the beautiful sandstone cliffs, the gorgeous sunrises and sunsets, and the clouds that come over the mountains on those cloudy days that we have here, and all of those beautiful hiking trails all around you without even having to go into the Red Rock Canyon area. One of the best things I like when I'm hiking in Red Rock Canyon is that you get to take advantage of all of the natural wildlife that Red Rock has to offer. This community is actually being built where an old mining town replica was called Bonnie Springs. This was a replica of an 1880s mining town and had really cool things like a petting zoo, they featured melodramas um, a few times a day, there was a saloon, and they even had trail riding on horseback. It's actually where I rode my very first horse. It wasn't the best experience ever, but it is where I began my love of horses. Before we continue, my name is Lisa Lopez, your trusted real estate consultant. I drop videos every week that share ways to make your luxury life more simplified. For more videos like this, don't forget, like, subscribe, and hit the bell so you get notified each time I drop a new video. Okay, let's go ahead and move on. The reserve at Red Rock Canyon will consist of 16 custom home sites, which you will be able to purchase and choose your own custom home builder as long as you keep in line with their design concepts as seen here. Check out the elevations of the designs that they have in store for you. First, let's check out this traditional style. I really like how they incorporate the rugged mountain surroundings, yet still are able to provide nothing less than the luxury lifestyle that its future homeowners are going to demand. And here in the Canyon Contemporary style, you can see the simplicity of the Mojave Desert, yet it still provides big open spaces where the interiors disappear into the nature surroundings outside. But again, you will be able to design your custom home the way you want it, as long as you're keeping within their design guidelines that they've set forth. But I really like this traditional style over the contemporary one, which is a little strange because I generally lean more towards like modern contemporary styles. Maybe it's because I grew up going to that old replica town and I really like to preserve that in my mind or because I still go to those hiking trails now and enjoy the beauty that Vegas has to offer outside of the city. Whatever it is, I really do like this traditional style of architecture out here. So which one do you prefer? I really wanna know, tell me in the comments below, do you prefer A, the traditional style for this type of neighborhood or B, the, the Canyon Contemporary one? Don't forget, let me know in the comments below. Although there's still very little information on the details of the entire community, it has been rumored that each lot will be about one to two acres in size and the starting prices will be 
six million dollars. It's also rumored that that spec home that Blue Heron will be building out there will be in the range of 20 to 30 million dollars. So if you think you might be interested in this neighborhood, you have to be sure that you have the budget because it's going to take some pretty deep pockets to build out there. So you may be asking yourself, what are the important factors that go into designing a neighborhood such as this and designing your residence in a neighborhood such as this? Well, as you could imagine, the amenities are going to be very important, especially because it's a little off the beaten track. 20, 25 minutes to get to the nearest grocery store or shopping center or dining can be challenging for some, but the residences are also a very important detail when designing something like this, especially in nature. So when planning the development of this community, they realized that the residences would not be able to have any strip views at all because of its location. There are mountains on both sides of this community. So they promised to situate every single lot and all of the community amenities with jaw-dropping views of the surrounding mountains which I think is very important because there was a lot of pushback from the Las Vegas community on even developing this land. They were very upset because they wanted to be able to preserve the nature of Red Rock Canyon, which is understandable. So I think that these developers succeeded in embracing the nature and all of its surroundings, yet still providing these luxury homes, a very nice community and great amenities, keeping these mountains and all the nature as the focal point. Since the place you'll be calling home doesn't necessarily start with your residence, it starts as you pull through those beautiful guarded gates and where you come together as a community within your neighborhood to enjoy social events and be able to take in all of those breathtaking views that Red Rock Canyon has to offer. If you choose this community to be your home, you will be able to take advantage of a full service restaurant, two event lawns, an event barn, and there's even a planned hotel in the mix. And let's not forget, its location alone lends to miles and miles of nature walks, hiking trails, and beautiful scenery. However the reserve at Red Rock turns out, I'm sure it will be done in the most elegant, environmentally conscious way that will provide its residents only the best options. So I know I talked a little bit about the distance of the community to the Summerlin area, but what I didn't mention was the distance to the southwest side of Las Vegas. The closest area in the southwest would be Mountain's Edge. And there are some shopping and dining options there, but if I lived in the reserve at Red Rock, I think I would be frequenting the Summerlin area more than the southwest because in Summerlin, you just have so many more dining, shopping, banking, business options out there. You also have other schools that you can attend. There's public schools on both sides, but Summerlin has a lot of those private school options that the Southwest does not. I don't think it's unrealistic to drive 20 minutes to these day-to-day -day necessities for the trade-off of the peace and tranquility that you get when living out in these nature preserves. What do you guys think? I'd love to know your thoughts. Would you live out in these nature type communities for the trade-off of driving a little bit further to go grocery shopping? Let me know again in the comments below. I hope you enjoyed learning about this new luxury community that Vegas has planned for you. I know I love learning about them and watching them develop over time so that I can bring you all the information along the way. For more videos about Las Vegas and Henderson, make sure to check out my playlist and don't forget to hit the bell so you get notified each time I drop a new video. Thank you so much for watching and I will see you next week. Bye for now.